Hi guys, Rachel Bop here. Today I'm reviewing an app called Tiny Tower and this is for blue, purple and pink on YouTube. They requested it. If you want an app reviewing, you can request it below in the comments and I will review it for you eventually. I have a lot of video requests so there is a bit of a line but I will do it. So this is a little game app. It goes to the game centre and it's called Tiny Tower. It's completely free. It's made by Nimblebit LLC and it's got four and a half stars in the App Store based on 2,957 ratings, so that's pretty good. Here's what it says it does. Tiny Tower lets you build a tiny tower and manage the businesses and bitizens that inhabit it. They call them bitizens, the display is like an 8-bit display, so they all look bitty. Make money to build new types of floors and attract bitizens to live and work inside. Special events and VIP visitors will earn you special perks as you build your tower towards the clouds. Customise the look and placement of each floor and the bitizens that live in them and upgrade your elevator. Game Center integration to let you see your friends' towers, back up your game and earn awards. See what is on your bitizens' mind by peeking at the Bitbook virtual social network of your tower. So it sounds pretty cool and I can say it is. It starts off with the tutorial mode and you basically start with like a few coins, a few thousand coins and zero cash and you spend your coin, you have like, there's like an elevator along the left hand side and then there's your floors that are unconstructed and it just shows you how to so construct a level that you spend your coins, it tells you how many, how much that's going to cost. You have a lobby, then you have storage apartments and then you get a vegan food restaurant and then after that it's up to you what you have, it tells you what the demand for each type of floor is so you can choose it depending on what the people living in your apartment want and people come to the elevator you tell them which floor they go to sometimes they have like a little thought bubble with a number in it which i presume is which floor they want to go to you start earning money you get one book every time as in a dollar every time you build a floor so you can use that dollar to speed up the production of the floor which is good so it would take like so many hours but you can just speed it up because you're always going to get that dollar so that's really good because some games really are let down with that aspect it's really really cute sometimes you get little VIPs and they add certain things to your level you hire staff once you've moved people into your apartments you can use them as staff for each floor I think you can have three members of staff for each floor it's really really good then you can check in on your bittersons, if you go to the menu, you can see your bittersons, you can see if they're unemployed, where they're employed, which floor they're employed on, if they're happy or not. Kind of a little bit like a theme hospital kind of setup. I don't know if you guys have ever played theme hospital. I surely should hope so. You can check in on your game centre to see what achievements you can get, which is always good. We like achievements. You can see your friends that are there. If you want to add me, in the game centre, my username is Bop Jelly. You can see your stats, so you can see your business demand, the sales that you get per minute, and the floor di distribution of food, service, recreation, retail, creative and residential. You can also check in on your elevators and upgrade that. That costs $25. You can buy more coins with your dollars, or you can buy dollars with your coins. There's also a bit book, like it said in the App Store, where you can check in on all your bitizens and they, their little, it's like comes up like a Facebook wall of like little status updates from the bitizens of things like, for example, I've got one saying, does anyone feel like helping me put together some furniture? And then so another bitizen will just click like and then you can go to that bitizen in your game and help them. It then also gives you missions. At the moment I've got 38 missions. There's one called Santa Swap. This one says the children in your tower need cookies for Santa in exchange for their toys and you can accept that it costs you so many dollars to complete them. And you can also share your tower. So you can share a picture of your tower. You can basically tweet that 
save the image, share it, whatever you want to do. So, like, it's really good. And it's really deep, but really simple at the same time. And I think they've filled all aspects there needed so that's really really cool i really really love this game and thank you so much purple blue and pink for telling me about it because i really love it i'm gonna keep it and carry on and if you guys add me maybe we can be a little bit competitive rich pop jelly i'm gonna give tiny tower five big fat moves i love it that much and i think you guys should all get it if you haven't already let me know in the comments if you're gonna get it if you've got it what you think of it etc don't forget to like this video subscribe if you haven't already share it with your friends and enemies i love you guys and i'll see you tomorrow bye hi guys rich Bob here today i'm doing an app review of flipboard this was requested by sky 01566 this is a free app available in the app store